Hello, everyone. Good evening, good evening, good evening. And thank you all so much for joining me on today. I'm going to give everyone just another 30 to 60 seconds to get their notifications, you all. And we're going to get started. We can't really wait too long because this isn't a long live um, because it just doesn't take long to make. So hang tight with us. Let us know where you're watching from. In the meantime, I am going to let my special guests come in and introduce themselves. They are going to make Egg Foo Young with us tonight. They told me, hey, I've always wanted to try this. So can I make it with you? I said, absolutely. So Maggie, come on in, honey. Introduce yourself. <laughs> Hello, everyone. We're going to give everybody about one or two more minutes, okay? And then we'll get yes, started. Sir. Absolutely. Everybody come on in. We see you in the chat. So happy to be here with Miss Aisha. I saw this class. I've never made egg foo young before. So I have my counter ready to go. You all are going to see me cooking along in real time. So I'll take myself. Uh, but I'm very excited. So yay, yay, yay. But I am the student. Miss Aisha is the teacher. So I'm here to listen and learn. So let's see, how's everybody doing? Hey, Dana, thank you for being here. Denise is uh, checking in from Massachusetts. Hello, hello. Chesterfield, Virginia, I used to live in, in Chester. Hey, Patricia, thank you so much for being here. Hello, Marcia, or is it Marcia? Thank you so much for being here. Hello, everyone. Yes, 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 thank you all. Thank you all. Miss Aisha said, we'll give it just a moment, let everyone get there. Yes. And Maggie, if you can let everybody know, how can they follow you? And we'll Absolutely. take care of that now, and then that way we won't have to worry about it at the end. Absolutely. So thank you so much for the opportunity. I am Maggie, the substitute teacher. So I am on all platforms, Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, uh, Twitter, and now my first stream on TikTok. Thank you all for the support. I'm the substitute teacher because I eat sugar-free dairy-free and gluten-free. So I'm going to be doing mine on cauliflower rice to stay gluten-free. I do have the other ingredients, but if you want healthy alternatives to some of your favorite meals, that's where you can find me, Maggie, the substitute teacher, and I do stream every day. So thank you so much, Miss Aisha. All right. Okay, everybody, let's get started. So Today, I'm going to do a shrimp egg foo young, and I'm going to tell you all something. I grew up in St. Louis, Missouri, and it's just a staple there. The shrimp egg foo young, the St. Paul's, not even just shrimp egg foo young. You can do pork, beef, chicken, shrimp. You can do whatever you like or just vegetable. So growing up there, I got accustomed to egg foo young as well as St. Paul which is pretty much the same thing. The egg foo young just has the gravy. You eat it with rice. And then the St. Paul, you eat it on bread, the egg patty. So I'm going to show you all my simple way to make a delicious egg foo young. Today, I am using shrimp. Now, the instructions I gave you all when I gave you the ingredients list is you needed to have your meat already cooked and chopped up, okay? So if you're using chicken, pork, beef, any of those items, they need to already be cooked and cooled, okay? Unless you're using shrimp, this is the only thing that you don't need to cook or like something that, you know, like crab meat that cooks really quickly. You don't have to worry about that. Now, in my egg foo young patty, I also like to have diced onion. So I have that. And then I also have some fresh bean sprouts. So if you like these items, they're good in your egg foo young. If you don't, don't worry about it. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to start with making our gravy, okay, so that it can be simmering. So Maggie, you ready over there? I will be, yes, ma'am. Okay. So now what, now Maggie, what are you doing now? Are you dicing up your Yes, ma'am. I'm doing the, I got the John Soul steak, so I'm just cutting that up. Oh, the, awesome. So, yes, ma'am. Oh, that's going to be good. Okay. So in the meantime, Maggie, um, we're going to go ahead and put on our water for our gravy because we need to go ahead and make that first. The egg foo young patties are very quick to make, so we're not going to, it's not going to take a lot of time. We want to already have that gravy ready. And I told you all to make sure, uh-oh, I told you to make sure that you already have your rice done, okay? So if you don't, that's fine, but you can't put it together at the end and taste it if you don't have everything together. So we're going to come over here. Okay, you don't cauliflower rice? All righty. <laughs> so let's come over here and make this gravy. Now, I'm going to tell you something. I'm going to tell you how I found out the secret to the gravy in St. Louis. So there's a restaurant, a Chinese spot I used to go to in St. Louis uh, for many years. 
And one day we just asked them, like, what's the secret to the gravy? And they said, beef bouillon. Okay. Honey, when I tried it, they told the truth. Now, they didn't tell all their secrets, but they did let us know that one of the key ingredients to a good gravy, the eggplant gravy, is the beef flavor. So I'm not going to make a whole lot, you all. We just had eggplant. So my kids are like, I don't want eggplant again. So I'm not going to make a whole lot tonight. Um, but just in case my older daughter, she loves it. In case she comes over, I'm going to make enough for her. So we're going to start by boiling some water. Now, feel free to use beef broth, um, but you don't need it because I'm going to tell you why. Okay, Miss Aisha, I have a question. Um, how much water and, yes, ma'am, I got the same thing, but how much water and am I doing that in the wok or I need a separate dish to boil the water in? All right, y'all, so I've messaged Aisha. Hopefully she gets my message. You can't hear, can you hear me? No sound? Let me. All right, y'all can hear me, but you can't hear Aisha. Okay. Um, and I know she is going. I'm going to drop her down. Okay. You hear me, but you can't hear her. Um, okay. I see. I see, guys. I don't want to kick her from her own. <laughs> Let's see. I'm going to drop her down and hopefully she'll see to come back up. All right. Bear with us, guys. I think we were just boiling water, but I couldn't hear anything either. I thought it was just me. Hopefully she gets this and comes right back. So sorry, no sound. Okay, she says stay on and go out and come back in. Okay, so here she comes. Y'all, we're going to make it work. All right, she's in the comments saying, hang on, hang on y'all. All right, so what I'm doing just for now, I've got the cauliflower rice in the microwave. Here she is. Okay, can you hear me? Can you? Yes, ma'am.
All right. Looks like the same thing happened. I don't know if you guys can hear her or hear me. <laughs> I think uh, she's boiling water. No sound again. Aye. Okay. So I think, yeah, I think when I come in, it's messing up the sound. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to, you all can hear me? Okay. They can hear me, but they can't hear Aisha. Let me kick her again. All right, y'all. So we got to choose. Put in the chat. I'm just going to leave my counter on when she comes back on and we'll just leave it. I won't be able to, I know what I can do. And I'll unmute. I'll mute my. All right. Her sound is the one that keeps cutting. All right. You hear me, but not Aisha. I hear you. Okay. So when she comes back on, I'm just going to leave the counter on y'all because I think the back and forth is what's messing it up. So. As soon as she comes back on, I'll just take one off and leave the counter on so you all can see. And we're using StreamYard. <laughs> Here she is. All right. Bye, y'all. Here I go. Okay, we can't keep having these type of interruptions because people are going to miss things, you know, so we may have to just end this live. Um, we'll see how it goes. So I added in about two hefty tablespoons of the beef broth. So let me check my comments. I did turn my pot down to a medium. So if you're making this, add in a couple of your tablespoons, turn it down to where it's about on a medium heat, okay? I need to see my comments because if you can't hear me, we just don't have to cut the live. I can't, I can't do this like this. So it doesn't make sense if you all can't hear me. So let me know where we are. Okay, working now. All right. Okay, you all. I'm sorry. Okay, you all. I'm sorry. I made a mistake, but it's okay. Not on the food, but on something else. All right. So you all can hear me. All right. So I turned it down to a medium heat. Go back up a little bit to like a medium, a medium high, but not on high. So on my stove, I'm like on a number six. Okay. And you really could just kind of leave it about at a number five. You can leave it there because we'll still be able to make our gravy. All right, so we have to thicken up our gravy. And the only flavors you're going to need in your gravy is going to be your oyster sauce and your soy sauce. I know I didn't put soy sauce on the list, but I just kind of forgot. <laughs> Let's just be honest, I forgot. So I'm going to grab a cup, you all, and I'm going to put some of my cornstarch in it. So start again, like I said, with about two tablespoons. Oh, Lord. Hey, Maggie, <laughs> I made a mistake. <laughs> oh my goodness. Let me see. Hey, Maggie, I don't know if you can hear me. No, no, listen. <laughs> We have to go back in the Facebook. Hold on one second. We have to go back. My Facebook live is cut off. So I'm going to pause for a second. I don't know if you can hear me.
I can hear you. I just didn't want to mess up the sound again. Oh, no, no. I'm going to tell you what happened. So StreamYard does something weird um, where it shows me commenting, but it's not me. But it's because of StreamYard. So I blocked it from my page. So now I have to go. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Um. So you can't see. If you go to my Facebook, you can't see. Yeah, it tells me it's lost access to the Facebook account. We are still streaming on your YouTube page and my YouTube page, but there is a button that says click here to reconnect your destination, but you would need to log in. But I can do whatever you would like me to do. Okay. I turned my pot down, as you can see. Uh -huh. So let me see if I can go back in. Let me go on StreamYard. And um, let, me, let me do this real quick, and then you can connect it. Yeah, actually, if I text you a link, there should be a button on there that says stream to your pages that might work. Um, let's see. You can do that. Are you going to text it or are you going to? How would you like it? I could do either way. Uh, e you can email it. Email it. All right, let me go to my other device. I'll grab the link and email it to you. Uh-oh. Because I don't, know, so I don't we'll even get... know how to go back in and get access anymore because... No problem at all. Writing. No problem at all. I don't know why it all. does that. All right. So let's go into StreamYard. And okay. I've got the link copied. Let me go into my mail. I'll text it and email it so you have both. Okay. All right, so the text has gone through, getting the email open. Oh, wait. Okay, so are we, let me do a test comment. Uh, we should no, be good. Um, let's see. I unblocked it. So do you, can you check that? All right. Let's see. Um, let's do a test comment. Mm -mm. Yeah, it's still saying, but you know what? Um, well, hold on, because it's unblocked. So all we have to do now is um, add it to a destination. That's all. Hold yeah. On. Okay. Let's see if I can. Let me go out and do that. I'll be right. It's reconnected. Try it again. Yeah, it's just asking me to log in and um, to reconnect to Facebook. Um, but I reconnected it, so I wonder why it's doing that. All right, let me refresh the browser, see if that helps. Okay, yeah. Struggle stream. Mm -mm. It's still not doing it? Yeah, when I click click here to reconnect your destinations, it's bringing up the Facebook login page. Um, okay, you. but that's the thing. You can't reconnect it. I already did. Okay. So I already reconnected it. So should we just, what do we have to do? Just start over? Um, I can. Or what should we do? Because I can't share it to my... Um, 
I can't share it. Let me see. Maybe I can share my YouTube. Maybe. Not and came back in to see if it reconnects on its own. When I send you the link, did, was there a button that says a uh, broadcast on your channels? Um, no. The only thing I got from StreamYard was the the code that I needed to reconnect to log in and to reconnect mine. It, it, but it wasn't from you. I had pushed it to the you know so I can log in. Uh, we're making egg foo young, Auntie Jenny. Um, let's see, let's see. I'm happy to. Um, I'm just because I see YouTube, a Facebook. It's just we're having trouble streaming to Facebook. It's possible that it deleted on Facebook. We'll keep trying and let you know if it's resolved. Please check Facebook to ensure that the stream looks okay. It says try creating a new broadcast. So I could just do I could just do a new broadcast and. Um, or just, oh, remove this destination and re-add it. Let me try. Okay. It's just telling me that I don't have access to the um, to edit the Facebook, so I can end it and uh, either recreate a new one, or you can just take it and I could I, I'll do whatever you want. But it's it's bringing me to the Facebook login screen where you would have to log in to reconnect it on the, on the Streamyard side. Okay. Well, let's let's end this one. Okay. And then let me know if you're not able to see like connected to all of them because I reconnected my pages. Okay. Um, and then if not, we'll just have to do, I guess, YouTube. I don't, I don't know, <laughs> yeah, but I'm, I'm at a standstill. So it's not like, you know, I haven't done anything. Okay. Same here. Um, so let me turn this down. So I'll end it and recreate uh, a new one and, uh, I'll send you an updated link if that's what you'd like to do and see if it lets me add all three. Cause it won't even let me take this one off. So I'll go ahead and, and everybody stay tight. We'll be right back. Okay. <laughs> 